What's up everybody, Neo here with Gadget Hacks. Today I'm going to show you how to use Google's Maps and Street View simultaneously to help make adventures and discovering new areas even easier. So all you need is an application called Street Panorama. Now what this does is basically splits your screen into two, the top being Street View, the bottom being Maps. Before getting started, let's head into the preferences. Under the preferences, there are some minor changes you can do to help tailor the experience to yourself. You can enable street names. You can also do a random country feature that every time you start the app takes you to a different country. You can do zoom gestures. You can do navigate, which basically move between to panoramas. And then there's the map types that you can select. There's terrain, satellite, hybrid, or normal. I'm going to stick to normal. And then you can put current location. So when you open it up, it'll just take you to your current location. So, let's go ahead and change the units. I'm not on the metric system. Let's go back now. And there you go. So it's pretty easy. You can use the search up here to put an exact address. You can do landmarks, country, city, you name it. Right now, I'm traveling to France, and let's take a look at the Eiffel Tower. So there are some small features you should know about when navigating. You can use your gestures to move around in street view if you wish. Or a little cool thing they added is um, using the volume rockers to actually move back and forth. So you can reduce the amount of smudges on your screen. So that's convenient. Also something you should know is on the map, when you want to jump from place to place, try not to, well actually you can't, don't pick up this little guy because you can't actually do that that well. Right now I'm getting lucky. But to actually jump from place to place, you're going to want to just tap and hold on a different area. There you go. That's the easiest way i found. Picking it up and uh, moving it around didn't work for me all the time. Sometimes it did, as you can see right now, but not all the time. So just make sure you are, you're aware of that. The application is free, but definitely check out the full guide. Get all the details and the links you need. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more awesome videos. And thanks for watching.